everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Bounty Hunter, episode 4. We are on our way to, I forgot his name, Lord Grathen's Estate. I should always know his name because I'm, I've been there many, many, many times. Oh, the world's glitching. I've been there many, many, many times. Um, God, it's been such a busy day, and it's going to get even busier for me. Um, yeah. Let's go to Grathen's Estate. Now, although I'm doing the Bounty Hunter every Monday, I do have to apologise if maybe, I don't know, one week is missed uh, over the next three or so weeks, because of course, when I'm in my new place, I'm not going to have any internet. Level 12! Hooray! I'm not going to have any internet, so I'm not actually going to be able to upload any videos until I get internet again. <sighs> so, I can only apologise, well, for the lack of videos. I mean, you already know that I am moving, but there's going to be a lack of. I also apologise if I sound a bit stuffy as well. When 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 clearing out the house, um, there's a lot of trapped dust that ends up coming free and going up my nose and yeah, gives me a bit of a sneezing fit and then a cold. So yeah, you don't want to be me right now. In fact, you don't want to be me at any time. I mean, I'm just... I just have the worst luck, the worst life, well, okay, it's not the worst life, you know, that people, you know, starving in countries are having a worse life than me, but in terms of, I don't know, first world, but first world, yeah, first world problems, yeah, first world problems, yeah, I just don't have the best luck. Oh, so by speaking to Veretta, I'm going to be killing the overlords anyway, ah, love it when things come together like that. I'll get to, no, I'll get to you in a minute. Let me kill the bonus mission, people. Okay, I've killed two. Where's the third one? Is he? Ah, he's there. Oh, they've changed the icon of things like that. Oh, it's a bit thinner than what it was. I don't know if I like the thinniness. I think I liked it the way it was. But uh, I guess I'll get used to it. Okay, now you can talk to me. Oh. Got click on you. Oh, what have we here? Oh! You're not even a Mandalorian, are you? Not yet. When Lord Grathen's spy said my father contacted the Mandalorian Enclave, I expected they'd at least send me a real live Mandalorian. I'm afraid I'm a tad disappointed. Oh, you shouldn't be, because you're going to die. You're going to be more than disappointed. Wonderful. I love that line. Oh, you have a lightsaber. It's not going to scare me because you're going to die. Oh, well, that's scaring me. Mako, you're being absolutely unhelpful right now. All you're doing is spinning around and around and around. Uh, what? I, I lost? You did. I can't lose. I'm Sith. That means nothing. Someone's been filling your head with garbage. Can't die like this. Fall into some common bounty hunter. Everything Lord Grothen told me was a lie. I've been living in a dream world. It can't end like this. It can't. Uh, actually, it can't. Uh, I'll do it quick. I feel for you, girl. Close your eyes now. I just can't believe it. She has a, a, a strange sort of niceness to her, doesn't she? You know, oh. I, I, yeah, I feel for you. Gotta kill you anyway, so. Eh. Hi, you gonna stop me this time? Go right in, please. Alright, I will, yeah. You won't stop me, will you? Reports of the raid on Lord Grathen's estate are pouring in. I trust you were successful in your endeavor. My daughter, Veretta, is. I'm sorry. This can't be easy for you. Thank you, Hunter. Empathy from one of your class level is surprising. Here, take your credits and go. You'll understand if I say I never want to see the face of my daughter's murderer again. What? How rude! Some people just don't appreciate my handiwork. Just go. Come on. He needs to be alone with what he's done. God, that line didn't come out the way it should have done. You know, it was all like, oh yeah, well, well thank you, thank you. Yes, yes, oh, here's your money. Now, now go! Now go! It's like, I just did your favor, man. I killed your daughter, and you're just hushing me away. All right, 
Fine. Oh, what new abilities do we have? Uh, flame sweep torches up to eight targets within five meters of that, and electro dart. Beautiful. Probably won't use them properly, but I'll use them nonetheless. Anyway, Krista, give me my third bounty, please. Second bounty is done. Just one more, and I'm in the melee. Right, you are. And competition is heating up. That little green girl, Iopian Rattle, finished all her bounties. Heard she poisoned an Imperial Moth. <gasps> Lucky we didn't get that one. Not sure how we'd work it out. Now, I ain't allowed details on whatever you were scrapping for Admiral Fabal. But I got a clearance note says it was duly scrapped. Nice payday, too. There was a squabble between the Admiral and his Sith daughter. Complicated. Sounds right tricky. But the less I know, the better. Here we go. Bounty three. I call it, someone's got a serious hate for my hunter. Oh. Top secret, crazy, red flag covered. This one's for a Captain Metal in Imperial Intelligence. No other information. What exactly is Imperial Intelligence? Spook arm of the Empire. Secrets, lies, and things that don't need asking about. Watch yourself with those people. Stay careful. Get this one done, and don't get yourself dead in the process. I mean, that's 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 not my intention to end up dead, but it just ends up happening with me. Oh, credits! Be more Thank you. Unless this is better. No, that's not better. No, that's not better. I need. Oh, that's better. Beautiful. I need to sell a bunch of this stuff as well. Um, but I don't know. Oh, that's you. It's even better than that one then. All right. Yeah, I don't know if I can be bothered right now. Where am I? Where am I going? Doesn't say where I'm actually going. Okay, let's go there. Let's go there. Oh, we need... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that's a codex entry. Hi, how you doing? Oh, why well, do you have to go across this uh, bridge that's not being held up by anything right now? How 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 is this bridge kind of standing? Right, so how do we say your name again? Is it Medal? Medal? Medley? Um, I'm going to go with uh, Medal. Or medal, yeah, that's medal as well. Soon you should ask if they're hiring. Well, hello? Is that you, God? Do you exist? What the? Oh, right. The bounty hunter. Glad you could make it. You nervous hunter. Parked in the middle of Imperial Intelligence and all. I can say one word, or touch one button, and you'd disappear forever. Poof. Gone. Just like that. No one would even dare to ask what happened to you. Just try it. Go ahead. Say the word. And see what happens. <laughs> Nicely done. I like you, Hunter. I really do. I never signed up for this cloak and dagger stuff. I was a regular soldier. Then one day, I put together a covert op raid that goes a little too well. And bam! I'm in Imperial Intelligence. Look, what I'm saying is the stuff that goes on in these halls is insane. And all of it is crazy hush-hush. So what I'm going to tell you has to stay just between you and me. Got it? And Mako, of course. It'd help if you ever actually told me something. Here's the deal. There's a huge ancient Sith temple on Drummond Cuss. Used to just sit there being scary. Now the place is crawling with Sith sorcery. And it's been ordered a no-go zone for everyone. Naturally, we sent a team in. My commander led that team. Nobody came back. We can't report any of them dead without reporting the mission, which puts me in a bind. Everybody knows about the temple. I still don't see what you need me for. If I can't prove my commander's dead, I can't take over his spot, which means an ugly power vacuum. I'm hiring you to enter that temple and find the team's ID cards, especially my commander's. I need those IDs to create more acceptable deaths for them. What if this commander and his team are still alive? They're not. And even if they are, they're not. Understood. Right. Make sure you find an Imperial commander named Gargan. Can't imagine there'll be more than one corpse in a temple wearing commander stripes. Grab no, no. all the team's ID cards and double time it back here quietly. Maybe I should just turn you in for once to just get someone's job. Just to check if they're dead. Yeah, yeah. But nah, I'll go get your ID tags and. You can be the commander. I'll be level 13 in three, two, one. I, I, I almost, almost had it. Just, I don't know, a split second short. I mean, I could technically, I don't know, take my voice out of sync and then it would sound right, but I'm already talking now, so 
<sighs> Can't trick ya. So just a thought I had whilst making my way to the temple. What do you think happens to the companions when you're on a mount? I mean, are they are they in the mount somehow? I mean, is Mako just stowed away in there or something? Oh, hi. How you doing? I cut off my holo receiver, but I can still hear them. If I lose it, please don't leave me down here. What what are you on about? Are you you you're on about the dead? You can hear the dead through your holo receiver or I don't know. Who are you referring to? The dead or the Imperials? One tag down. Four and more to go. Are you the thing I need? Yeah. I don't even think I gave him a chance to shoot. Literally, I didn't give him a chance to shoot. Oh well. Uh, you're not what I need. But you are! Oh! Ah! Oh, two! Well then. You disappear my way as well. And finally. You two, I'm gonna use flame sweep because that's an awesome ability. I do like that ability, and the fact you can move whilst using it as well. I mean, I don't know why you need to move while using it, and I don't know how it works because technically you're spinning whilst moving, whilst in the air. So I don't know. Unless you sort of, oh, you're probably doing that. To be fair, yeah. ignore what I just said. Hi, dead body. Okay. What are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing right now. Oh God, I think I'm possessed. Oh, you have slaves. I'm so jealous. What is this in front of me? Another worshipper? Who braves the flames of the altar of horror to stand in front of Lord Barrel Slathborn, Lord of the Sith? This tomb has driven you insane, Lord. Insane? No. Do not seek madness, but fear and hatred, the tools of the Sith. If you're not an Imperial Commander, then what's that ID card for? What madness do you speak? I have no... Oh, that. It seems the ID of some Imperial Commander I must have slain has stuck to my robes. Right. Do you wish to have it? A token of your visit with the great Lord Battle Slatborn? Uh, I, I just have... yeah. I'm afraid this job calls for you being dead. To me, my disciples! Who are you? God? Oh. You said to me, my disciples, but they're already, like, right next to you, so... You didn't need to shout. They're right in front of you. And art thou dead. Thank you. And return to Captain... We didn't establish how his name's pronounced. Is it Medal? 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 Medley? Med... La? Here you go, meh, 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 something meh. You got the IDs? Fantastic. Let me see. That's Commander Gargans, all right. What was it like in the Dark Temple? I've yet to hear anything that didn't sound like pure raving. There was an entire society in that temple. Well, kinda. Huh. Still wish I could have got it myself. Would have saved me some unpleasantness. Listen to me unpleasantness. I'm even starting to talk like a spy. Friend, remember when I said Sith didn't want anyone in the Dark Temple? That ain't sounding too good. I wish there was another way to handle this. I really do. I can't risk the Sith ever finding out you went into their precious Dark Temple, which means you're now a liability. Great. This isn't the way a fighting woman should die. God! Okay, fine. Yeah, you'll all die. Great. I mean, you had to bring your guards into it. I mean, they probably had families, yo. You, on the other hand, I mean, you, you probably did, but you didn't care enough or somehow they died. But these two, they had families. You dragged them into their deaths. I mean, you heartless bastard. Heartless. <laughs> that went wrong, didn't it? Got a hole in my gut. I'm not going to beg. Turning on someone who did their job is wrong. We both know it. Here's your writ. <clears throat> it tells the Mandalorians you did your job. And here's your pay. The rest is up to you. Bribe me, Captain, and do it well. That I can do. <clears throat> I've got all sorts of resources at my disposal. I'll send you some top-of-the-line weaponry as soon as you're out of here. That work for you? 
I suppose. You better be nice, or I'll come back. <laughs> Don't worry. That's not something I want. You're everything a woman should be. Wish I'd met you when... When I was still a man. What's done is done. Good hunting to you. Oh, are you transgender now? Oh, well then. Oh, Krista! Guess who's in the melee? I'll give you a hint. Be more careful. It's me. You're alive! Some Mandalorian big shot named Taro Blood said you were dead. They're about to start the melee without you. I can't wait to kill that man. You're gonna have to wait until after the melee. All the other hunters who survived are already inside. Get in there! I will do! If I die, bury my credits with me. No inheritance, huh? Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Don't get cute. Move! I mean, you are coming with me. So you'll probably die too, so... What up, Mandos? How thou? Well, I'm good. Thanks for asking. And the last hunter left standing joins the great hunt. Simple as that. All weapons are allowed, but you fight alone. No assistance. And it looks like we have a latecomer. Somebody made up a story I was dead. Your competitors were relieved to hear it. Too bad for them, huh? Huntmaster, will you do us the honor? Today, many hunters earn glory in death and defeat. One hunter earns eternal glory. Okay. Good hunting to all, thanks. Yeah. I've heard tales of your exploits, Hunter. Perhaps I'll turn them into a song to commemorate your death. Make sure it's something you can dance to. Consider it done. I'd wish you luck, but it wouldn't help. So I'll just say goodbye. Enough! You hunters are the best that the galaxy's goons and thug lords could send us. Now show us which one of you will join the great hunt. Fight! I mean, why has that green girl got a grudge on me? Also, why is Mako helping me? That's cheating! You shouldn't be able to help me, Mako. But, nonetheless, Ori, you can die first. And green girl, you can die now. Oh, you you were already shooting at me. Well, that's just not fair. I mean, you're going to die anyway. Level 40! Not 40, 14! I knew what I was trying to say, but I didn't come out the right way. Okay, and they're all dead. No, let me let me let me take the loot first. God, oh a belt. Is that belt any better than what I've already got? Uh, ish. The melee is over. One hunter remains. <laughs> Quite a show you put on. Blasted fun to watch. How do you feel, Hunter? I just stomped my competition into the dirt. I feel great. <laughs> Enjoy it. Things only get harder from here. And the hunters stand before me. She is honored beyond all common hunters. Let it be known that... This is simply ridiculous. I mean, really. This needs to stop right now. You die, scum. No! No! No unsanctioned kills in the Great Hunt. You see? That's a perfect example. I object to this farce. This ignorant thug does not deserve to enter the Great Hunt. Her credentials are a lie, fabricated by her little gutter rat of a sidekick. She deserves no honors. You lying, cheating, murdering scum! We know this hunter's history, blood. The Huntmaster has ruled. You fools! This is a place of honor, a competition of elites. Mandalore will hear of this. I sure hope you're not gonna cry. Enough! Before this great hunt is over, I will have your skull in my hands. He just, he's just, he's just admitted he's going to kill me! Well, the great hunt just got way more interesting. Sorry to interrupt, Huntmaster. Please continue. The Great Hunt proves talent, resolve, Mandalore calls it to bring him to the mo Each hunter will hunt the other's prey, then each hunter hunts the other. At the end, there is no prey and only one hunter. Thanks for letting me read all that. that hunter. No, I totally didn't. But. Just tell me that Tarot Blood is my prey. <laughs> if he isn't yet, he will be eventually. You'll be hunting targets spread across the galaxy. 
There'll be at least one other hunter going for them, too. You not only have to take down your target, you have to eliminate the other hunters. That seems simple enough. Today, you are truly the hunter, and all else is your prey. Welcome to the Great Hunt! Your handler, Krista, will fill you in on the rest of the details. She's waiting for you. Alright! Krista, where art thou? Krista is out here. Give me a ship! I need a ship. Oh, what a thrashing! The other handlers are all bug-eyed jealous you won. Now, on to the Great Hunt. I expect you want to hear about your targets. Did you see the mail? Of course she did! She just told you right there and then. Tell me everything I need to know. Here's how it's gonna work. First, you're getting a starship. Yay! No more shuttle rides for me. It ain't gonna be quite that easy. We'll talk about it in a second. On your ship's computer, you'll access two holo recordings, both with specific details on who and where you hunt. What's Taro Blood going to be doing? The same thing. That's how the Great Hunt works. Each target will have another hunter assigned to it. You have to locate that rival and take him out, too. Maybe we'll get lucky and Taro Blood will be on their first target. Now, about your ship, there's a tradition for new hunters. You gotta steal one for yourself. I can already tell this is gonna be a blast. That's what life is for a hunter. Now let's find you that perfect ship, yeah? Yeah. Gotcha. I know one that belongs to one of them so-called importer types. Fast, smooth, and roomy. I'll pull together your holo recordings for the great hunt targets and transmit them when you hit space. Meantime, head to the spaceport. Get past whatever guards are around, steal your ship, and hit the hyperlanes. What's my destination? Your first round of targets are on Balmora and Narshada. Good luck to you, Hunter. Okay, let's go steal ourselves a starship! Court Drive Yards, D5 Mantis Patrol Craft. Ooh, from the Court Drive Yards. Lovely. I, lo I love how as well, um, they kind of reference the Court Drive Yards um, in the Rogue One novels. Um, and I, I always thought the Kuwait Drive Yards was just something from, um, like, Old Republic, but I guess it is, like, in the, the actual canon films as well, so, there we are then. Proves how wrong I was. Oh, uh, we need this one. Um. Apparently it's always this gloomy. Oh. I know. I know. Well, it's usually a lot worse. It's usually raining, especially whenever I'm in my apartment. It's so weird. Every time I enter my apartment, it's always raining, and then whenever I leave, it's it's stop raining. I just like I don't I don't get it. La da 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 da. Hi. All right, you disgusting pile of puke. Drop your weapon and kiss the floor. Nah, I'd rather have that ship, thanks. This is one starship that's not getting stolen on my watch. You hear me, scum? I'm not here to steal anything. Honest. Better that thought had gone through your filthy, sub-intelligent brain before you stepped through that door. I've had three ships stolen this year by the Mandalorians and their unwashed cohorts. Of course, not all Mandalorians are bad. Taro Blood was nice enough to tell me about this little tradition of yours. <sighs> Damn you, Taro. I really need to kill that guy one of these days. Karakimi. Why are people talking? You caught the scum red handed. Now kill, kill, kill. That's racist! That's very racist! Yes, I am red handed. But what's that got to do with anything? You racist son of a gun. Okay. Um, let's go get my ship! God, how many am I having to kill? I swear I've killed like 15 already in this space pool alone. Crikey. Oh! There's going to be more as well, unless I can just sneak past. Lovely, and I can. Rules or no rules, Tarot Blood dies the next time we see him. Right? That scum is living on borrowed time. Oh, I hate this. I don't want to feel this way about anyone, but I just... I want to make him pay. Atta girl, get pumped. <sighs> Alright, let's get moving. We've got a Tarot Blood to kill and a great hunt to win. All right, but Tara Blood will have to wait before he is brutally murdered in the future as we end the episode. So, 
thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, as the... Oh, I was going to say, as the ship leaves the spaceport, but I guess not. Uh, level 15! Beautiful! Just in time. Uh, and I know as, I, as soon as I go a few steps forward, he's going to start talking to me, so I won't move a few steps forward. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and I shall see you next time, and a farewell to you.